flight went okay. Uh, I took a bus over to the town Aonang because it's close to a beach I want to check out. Um, this town is very uh, touristy, much more than I expected. I was expecting Krabby to be this way, but from what I've seen of Krabby just driving through, this seems way more. So I'm on my way to find my hostel now. Well, today I'm going to Rayleigh Beach. I've been really wanting to go to a beach since I've been in southern Thailand. I hear a lot of great things about them. But this is like the ultimate beach because you have to charter a boat to get to it because it's inaccessible by land. It's, it's about 9.45 in the morning, so I'm hoping it's not going to be busy. to catch a bus or a taxi to uh, Krabby Town proper. What's fun about buses here is you can literally just stand on the side of the road and flag them down. You gotta love Thailand. Alright, uh, 50 baht to go to Krabby Town. It's about $1.50? No, a dollar, like a dollar forty. Not bad for 20 kilometers. Well, just like I experienced before, Krabby is uh, much less touristy, much less busy than Anang. I found my hostel just fine, but uh, it's too early for me to check in. It's it's not even ten o'clock yet. Okay. Uh, it's it's too early for me to check in. So I'm gonna go find a coffee place to hang out for a bit. I've got a pretty bad sunburn on my back and shoulders, so lugging this backpack around is so much fun. Get it? Because I'm in Krabby.
not much, but uh, after sleeping in a bed literally a foot away from a dozen other strangers for the last, I don't know, two or three weeks, uh, it's nice to have my own private space. getting ready to do some laundry, like real laundry, <laughs> uh, in the machine. I've been washing my clothes in the sink every couple days or so, but it's not quite the same, you know? <laughs> um, I figure this is going to be my last cheap opportunity to do it before I get back into Bangkok. So, I'm going to do it. Some of them are really Really dirty. I've never used this stuff before and it's all in Thai, so uh, I hope I don't ruin my clothes. Yeah, it's probably enough. because tomorrow I fly back to Bangkok for two days, which I will be spending in a pretty nice four-star hotel uh, because I decided to go all out for my last couple days, really relax and like treat myself a bit. Um, and then I'll be flying home back to California on the 30th, and that will bring all this to a close, I guess. It's kind of bittersweet that after a month and a half, it's all just sort of ending. It seems very anticlimactic. You know, don't get me wrong, I'm excited to go home and see my friends and Lauren and my family and everything, but this was good for me. This is what I needed. <laughs> 